Hey, it's Janelle from Roadmonk. In this video, we'll be looking at how to set up and connect Azure DevOps in Roadmonk. Say goodbye to manually maintaining data in multiple places, because with Roadmonk's Azure DevOps integration, you can seamlessly sync your data between projects and roadmaps. This means that any changes you make to your work items can automatically be reflected in your roadmap and vice versa. The integration supports both one and two way syncs and offers scheduled syncs on a determined cadence, as well as manual sync options for complete control. Enjoy having the flexibility to set things up in a way that works best for you and your team. Setting up the integration is a simple one-time process. However, please note that in order to do so, you must be an account administrator. Okay, let's get started by first setting up the Azure DevOps integration in your Roadmonk account. We'll begin in Account Settings and head to the Integrations tab. From here, click Add an Integration and select Azure DevOps. We'll now enter some information about the server including the server name and the Azure DevOps organization URL. Once we click Create Integration, we'll be good to go. Now that you have the integration up and running, let's dig deeper into some of the powerful actions that you can perform with it. To set up your roadmap integration, click the Integrations icon in the top right-hand corner and select Set Up Azure DevOps Integration. To begin, we'll need to select our server, and this is the server that we just set up in Account Settings. Now we'll select our synchronization settings. You can either select a one-way synchronization or a two-way synchronization. A one-way sync pulls data from Azure DevOps into Roadmonk making Azure DevOps the source of truth, while a two-way sync automatically syncs data back and forth between Roadmonk and Azure DevOps, allowing you to make updates and push new items to the synced project, saving you time and keeping things streamlined. From the schedule dropdown, you can choose how frequently you like your sync to take place, eliminating any worries about double data entry and ensuring that the most current information is surfacing. If you choose no sync schedule, you can certainly perform manual syncs when the time is right. But the best part? You can set a sync schedule, yet also push manual updates so the information is always up to date, just like saving your work along the way. Now's the time to enter your Azure DevOps credentials. Once that's done, you can select which Azure DevOps work items you want to sync with Roadmonk. Start by choosing the Azure DevOps project you want to bring into this roadmap from the drop-down menu. Next, you can select which work item types you'd like to be brought in. And lastly, under Import Item History, you have the option to import work items from the past 30 days, 90 days, one year, or all work items. Note that choosing only future work items will import items into your roadmap that are created after today. All right, let's move on to the final step, which is selecting which fields to bring into this roadmap. You have the ability to map dates. From the drop down menu, you can choose which date field in Azure DevOps you'd like to have as your start date and your end date. You then can choose any additional dates to display for that added piece of context, as well as any additional fields that you would like to sync and showcase that are important to you. Once the fields are selected, we'll click Next, and let's go. 
Now, just wait a few seconds for everything to get added into your roadmap. But now we can see our work items and all the affiliated information from the selected fields. And with that, you're finished. Congratulations. You've officially set up the Roadmonk Azure DevOps integration.